Hello viewers and appreciate you watching today Joe, Shane and myself. I'm gonna go over the fifth wheel attachment made by Miller Industries on our trailer at our shop. So we'll get started with it. I'm gonna show these new drivers how it works. Shane, if you wanna go get that big plate that we got last time. And I'm gonna need them Miller, the end caps too. over and to the narrow stance just like that all right don't put that on yet we gotta have our end caps pins for that chain. big pin at. Back there. Back there. Okay. Where's it going? Hey. We're just hooking it up, what? showing them going through, showing them how it works. No, I'm outside sitting right here in front of me. You need a what? Okay. I'll tell. Alright. Miss Claudia needs you. Okay. You need a price. So she's got an Allstate coming in. You go take care of that, Mr. Wilbur, for me. Yeah. Thank you. All right, let's um back up. I 
put your pin in. Pull it back in until it, it'll, it'll straighten up a little bit. Pull it in. All right. A little bit more. All right. Hold right there. Take, um, pick up on it and boom it in. Boom up. You want to make sure you give yourself enough clearance here. That's pretty good right there. Push out on it, nice thing. All right, hold. <laughs> Pull back in. Get it level right there, and then chain your side, Joe. Come. Push out a little bit. All right. Inside, over. Pretty simple. You just got to know. You got to crank your landing gear up. Yep. And then hook up. You know, one for your your service air, one for your constant air. And just run your two air lines to it. All right. Take care. So this will be your, service. That's your service line. Yeah. And that'll be your constant. Right. And then you hook you, unplug your um, cordless lights. Plug it. Plug your short lights up. Okay. And you're good to go. We got a little curly cue we need to get for this one. A little. That's right. That's right there in the box. Next. Yeah, right there. put that in that box like you do your thing so you are we moving this trailer no okay. i'm just doing it yeah we got to move it but not right this second so and then just screw your landing gear up get your trailer level with your boom up and down and that's pretty much it all right break it down that'll work I just wanted y'all to see it. I figured y'all, I could probably walk you through it, but you see it in person, it's a lot easier. You know what this is rated for? No. 25,000 pounds. The plate? It's, it's rated to tow 25,000. Okay. So like that trailer you lifted this morning, you couldn't tow it. Yeah, because it's too heavy. Yeah. All right. So if, if it's something like that, we have to unload the trailer? No, you you or, don't want to tow too much with it, but you can, there's another hookup you can do. Um, I'll go over that with you one day. Okay. All right. So if it's an empty trailer, we can tow it like yeah, this? Yeah, up to 25,000 pounds. Okay. And it, it's all about, you know, surface area. Right.
which I don't like to tow much more than that anyhow because it takes all your weight off your front axle. Right. I don't think I've ever towed that pin there goes um both of them go in that really. All the time? Yeah. All right. Well that one goes between that one and the other. Yeah, uh, it can be used hitch. either way, like Shane and I did the uh, kingpin attachment tow the other day. Right. It goes in here. And it could go it can go either way. I think we had it in here. Yeah. Okay, viewers, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and if you like our content and channel, please subscribe. And as always, stay safe out there, and we'll catch you on the next one.